breaking news. Peter Obi finally replies Shetima after he said he can only become president of the Igbo land, not Nigeria. According to a report shared by Vanguard, the presidential flag bearer of the Labour Party and the former governor of Anambra State, Peter Obi, has sent a message to Senator Kasim Shetima, the vice presidential candidate of the ruling All Progressive Congress, after he claimed that Peter Obi can never become the president of Nigeria because it would be too big for him to handle. The former governor of Borono State, in an interview with Chan Chinese TV, stated that Peter Obi can only be the president of the Igbo land. Peter Obi, during an interview with Vanguard, stated that the statement made by Karsim Shetima is a threat to the unity enjoyed in the, com in the country. He further went on to say that he has satisfied all the requirements needed to contest for the office of the president. I have heard all kinds of things, some of which are statements that these, those in positions of authority should not make. Previously, one of the contenders for presidential for president claimed that a certain segment of the country should not support him. Such ways, in my opinion, degrades the political system and cast doubt, doubt on the harmony and love we are to feel for one another. I am confident that I have met the requirements set forth by INEC for running in the elections. I am unsure of any unique qualities that is principal, the APC candidate holds that I do not, I do not, and I believe I am, I am better suited than his principal for the position. Is it age qualification? Is it education? Is it in terms of being an entrepreneur? So what else did they want to say? Well, Shatima have just said what he want to say. is lazy and lacks respect for his seniors. Shatima's comment is indeed uncivilized un 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 and hate speech. Some comment he made against the vice president Yemi Usibanjo that Usibanjo can only be good for selling ice cream. Shatima Kasima is not qualified to be vice president of Nigeria. His comments are cruel, unrefined, and lacks substances and not diplomatic. It's time for fire for fire. Look at Shatima talk about Obi not qualified to rule Nigeria, a known terrorist, Boko Haram sponsor, and one that never contributed any voice on any issue in the Senate. Is comparing himself to a caliber like Obi. Don't blame him. It is quota system that pop up people like Kasima to a political power. You have just said it all. Only Nigeria does not examine their conscience while voting criminals. APC has a hidden agenda which they want to achieve through Tinubu, and God will not allow them win. I believe you, my brother. May God help us to wake up from our sleep because the ordinary Nigerians can be deceived by money. That is why the elites want us to remain poor so that we cannot know our rights. Shatima is a Boko Haram Islamic terrorist. He should be in jail by now for selling Chibok school Christian girl students to a sponsored Boko Haram terrorist. Never compare the might of an elephant with that of a cockroach. It will be suicidal. Peter Obi is like an elephant and cannot be compared with a cockroach like bat that flies in the night. An ugly animal. Kia chineke. Okay, someone said, mind, mind your choice of ways. I don't believe you are truly Igbo. Okay, guys, these are reactions by Nigerians, and they keep on talking. What Shatima says is not different from what any cow from the north 
will say, his speech that is punishable by hanging. Let him state what, what way his principal, Boari, is more qualified than Peter Obi. Apparently, this Shatima is unfit for president. He is actually a minus for Tinubu. Any presidential candidate that talks like Shatima and Kwan Kwasu has surely unworthy of the office of president. Igbos can't allow to rule Nigeria. Never and never. Peter Obi is a joke. Nobody will allow him to rule Nigeria. He said, you should go and rule Biafra, not Nigeria. You are not serious, so are you God? Reactions are getting tough. Cow man like you that's supposed to be living inside the bush. Can you say just three qualities that your Fulani people have that made them to be more suitable to rule Nigeria better than an Igbo person? Okay. These are reactions by Nigerians for the fact that we are all Nigerians. Everybody, you know, is qualified to rule Nigeria. Okay. So, guys, what's your take concerning this? According to a report shared by Vanguard, the presidential flag bearer of the Labour Party and the former governor of Anambra State, Peter Obi, has sent a message to the Senator Kasim Shetima, the vice presidential candidate of the ruling All Progressive Congress, after he claimed that Peter Obi can never become the president of Nigeria because it would be too big for him to handle. The former governor of Boronu State, in an interview with Channel TV, stated that Peter Obi can only be the president of the Igbo land. Though this got so many reactions from Nigerians and all that. Nigerians are saying that people like this cannot rule Nigeria. So I'm dropping it here, guys. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Thank you very much for always having you here. Bye for now.